The humpback whale, a sea giant weighing 30 tons, travels thousands of kilometers to feed here, near the Santa Ines glacier, in the fjords of the Chilean Patagonia. But climate change could upset its life cycle. The glacier is retreating, revealing rocks that were once invisible and spilling vast amounts of fresh water into the ocean. This could have serious consequences for whales, because if water composition changes, it could harm their food supply. A modification within the microalgae could generate changes in the secondary structure or in the animals that feed on it. Normally, the more microalgae there are, the more zooplankton, which feeds on the microalgae, will be able to feed and transmit this energy to higher levels in the food chain, such as to whales, dolphins or sea lions that live in the area. After two days of sailing through the Strait of Magellan, this group of researchers arrive at the foot of the glacier to recover this buoy, which has been immersed for eight months. The sensors hanging from it, 10 meters deep, have recorded valuable information on the water, such as temperature and acidity. This data allows them to closely monitor changes in the ecosystem. This per se is like nature's own unique experiment. This allows us, without having to do laboratory experiments, just by taking measurements to know what would happen in similar conditions without having to imagine it. As the planet warms, areas close to the poles are particularly vulnerable to climate change. Researchers say that understanding what's happening in the Sierra and Patagonia could give them a glimpse into the future, helping them predict how climate change will affect other places by the end of the century. High-latitude waters, whether in the northern or southern hemisphere, contain a large amount of environmental information that could serve as a basis for making important decisions about the conservation plans of developed countries and of all countries in general. In the meantime, the sensor is put back into the water to watch over the melting glacier and the ocean's gentle giants.